Hi everybody, welcome back to the craft room and day 18 of our advent calendar. Today is this beautiful little fox. I've had a little think about what I'm going to do and I've pulled a few bits and pieces out. You'll have to excuse me today, I've I had a very bad migraine yesterday and um, I was quite sick so my throat is not feeling great but I'm fine but my throat is um, is very sore so I've got a bit of a strange voice today I pulled out this die from day 13 I want to say if it's not 13 I'll put what day it is but I'm pretty sure it was 13 so I'm going to use that one I've got this paper rose clouds stencil so I thought I would use that I've got this these Lavinia trees which I thought I might use and I've got some distress ink so I think I'm going to do this is lost shadow I think I'm going to do sort of greys and blacks for the clouds and the trees and whatever and then he's going to be a nice bright colour so that is the plan the first thing I'm going to do is get this cut I'm not going to cut that until later that can be later so I will just get him cut a few times and then we'll crack on with some colouring so I will be right back so I've cut him four times I'm going to do some stacking so he's going to be stacked up and I'm going to do some snipping as well <clears throat> so let me grab some pens out okay so I pulled out some orangey browns just check what to do his bad leg a little bit dark and that one that goes behind that's the only bit so I'm going to do his leg in a grey I've got these greys 0512 four and six but I think Foxy's legs are a little bit dark so do that dark into a lighter one the only bits I'm doing on him I think because I'm going to lay the next bit up so I'm going to cut off his back leg here and that leg there get him coloured. I'm thinking I'm going to do white and white. The rest of him is going to be orangey brown. So let's do 
his leg tummy is going to be a bit darker back of his leg is going to be darker and under his tail there's a bit of dark on his ears there A bit lighter, leaving some areas to do the highlights. Put that brown down just a little bit more. Yep, I think that's okay. I'm going to go around him though with a darker pen just to take the white away. Do a bit of shadow for his white parts. His face should be red, shouldn't it? White up to his cheeks. So I think he's white up to his cheeks. So let's just do a little bit on his cheek there. Just a little bit of shading. <coughs> gone a bit too high with that or low with that. I'm just going to bleach that out a little bit with some of a lighter colour. And stick him on there. together and I might just give him one more layer it's 
so there he is. Get a black fine liner just to do his eye. I don't want too much of it going on there, but I want a hint of it and nose. Save him for later. Fox done. Clean up time. The next piece I'm going to do is the background. I'm going to ink it first and stamp it first before I cut it. So I'm just going to do a guide. Whereabouts I'm doing this. And with some ink. Where's the clouds going on in there? some bubbly clouds up there like that. Grounding a scrap of paper for this. And I'm just going to cut a oops, too much piece like that and piece like that. So I'm just going to do a bit of grounding there. So let's cut that out now. big I think we might just do the smaller tree I think that would be too big on there so we won't do that one pop him back
like that. Let me get tidied up and we'll get the card put together. I went to a Do a mock black layer on there, maybe. Let me get him stuck down first. under his feet. <laughs> Let me cut a mat layer and see if I want to put that on the mat layer. What is this? off of there. Let me get that stuck down. Today's card, bit of a quicker one today. Beautiful fox. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay.